ahead and say it. Merry Christmas. We shall read in Hebrews 10, 14. Kuko abezwa yabatunganishije rwose igitambo kimwe kugeza iteka ryose. It is in Hebrews 10 verse 14. Nanye ndashima Imana yuko yangiriye ubuntu ikamagakiza. I'm thankful to God that he embraced me and he saved me. Eh nabaye ho nabaye mu madini menshi nshaka kugira amahoro mu mutima wanje. So I lived in many churches uh with the Heart to have a peace in my heart. Nariko buri rusengero rwose nageragamo nasangaga nta gihindutse nasigaraga n'ubundi nici rubanza mu kimwe wanje. But in every church I attended there was no change because I remained with the condemnation still. Nagiye mu nsengero nyinshi ntashobora kurondora zose. So I visited many churches which I can't mention. Yekegeze ndavanga iby'insengero reka mbireke reka nicarire mu rugo. And the time came where I decided to not attend any church. Uh, so when I was at my house, I was caught by a sickness. And there I decided to not attend any church because my goal was not achieved. I lived in Uganda. So, and I came here because I have a, an elder sister who gathers in this church. So, I came here and I was listening the word, but it was a challenge. So but even if it was a kind of a confusion, God gave me the heart to keep on listening. So I kept I kept on attending, saying what about this message? Uh, but I told myself, let me keep on listening. So when I attended and the that day they read this verse of Hebrews 10. And the verse says that Jesus died once for all our sins to be forgiven. So I was very happy for that day. So I made phone calls to my family with the joy saying, uh, now I have achieved what I have been looking for. I thank God for that joy and grace. And I'm also thankful to God that he gave me a true church where I gather and I receive uh, the new uh, and the good message. And I live the happy life because the word of God gives the joy uh, to my heart. Yesterday, I was blessed to receive baptism. Even if I received the salvation and my sins were forgiven, so even before I received the baptism, which told us that uh, our sins are washed, but the condemnation uh, kept on arising in our hearts. But the, the baptism we received yesterday, it is actually to proclaim that we died with Christ, raise up with him, and now we are holy. And uh, yesterday, during baptism, uh, pastor prayed for me the very good prayer. 
yaravuze ngo ntabo gakiri Lorence ahubwo abaye Lorence umushya cyangwa se abaye Yesu ntabo gari Lorence wa cyero uzaje ugaragara ahubwo ni Yesu uzaje ugaragara muri So he prayed saying she's, she's no longer Lorence of before but now she's new Lorence and she will not appear but Jesus will always appear instead so I thank God for such blessing. And in the previous sermon, uh, Pastor mentioned a very good word. Uh, he mentioned the story of a donkey which was tied. And it was an clean animal. Uh, but Jesus ordered his uh, disciples to go and release the donkey. Even if it was unclean. But it was released. And Jesus sat on it. And it was going in glory. And this represents me. I was not worthy. I was an Ukraine. But when Jesus entered in me, I'm great and I'm precious. May God bless you.